Well, a revival in the slow food culture and 100 mile diet is kicking a once revolutionary diet to the curb on the island. The Atkins diet curbed many people's loves of carbs and sweets. But now renaissance of baking and emphasis on home cooking is changing all that. And it's changing the future of classfuls of students in Nanaimo. They're each as different as the baked goods they delicately prepare. Just that tiny amount. Captured in this candid moment as our cameras rolled, unexpectedly frightening one girl, creating a ham out of another. Their common ground is baking. They've come to Nanaimo's Vancouver Island University from across Canada to pursue it. Oh, it's going so great. We're doing so many different things I've never done before. And it is really wonderful to know that I'm heading finally, after all these years, into something I want to do. Take 56-year-old Paul Laboud. He moved from Ontario for this, leaving behind a job as a telemarketer. It's night and day. It's like you're out of the shackles. 29-year-old Kevin Friesen took the leap from Winnipeg, a year into university towards becoming an architect. And uh, one day hoping to own my own bakery. The demand is so high that this baking program has doubled its size this year, from 18 students to 35. It's a complete turnaround from what the baking industry has gone through over the past decade, when it was hit by a movement banishing bread and baking. Basically, it's about refined carbohydrates. Uh, that's sugar and flour. Courtesy of a worldwide phenomenon called the Atkins diet. I got off the diet roller coaster and made Atkins my lifestyle. You can too. The whole Atkins diet took the industry uh, completely unprepared and, it, and it, there was a many, many businesses, many bakeries that went out of business because of that. But a return to healthy carbohydrate choices and whole foods has inspired a whole new future now for baking. You know, certainly across here on the island, there's more and more of our, of our artisan style bakeries. Nanaimo's Malpiti Chou is one of them. It's memorable. I mean, that's what food should be. Is, is, it should be memorable. It should be tasty. It shouldn't be some plastic you eat in a car that just to get you by. If, whenever we eat, we should eat with pleasure. And that's, the, here it is. Made the old-fashioned way, all by recent grads of VIU's baking program. They're passionate about the whole foods, like doing croissants from scratch, doing puff pastries from scratch, that layering of, of butter and dough. A recipe of success. You need to be a little more melted. That so sounds mouth-watering to students like Paul Abood. Oh, for sure. This is really, really amazing. It's such a change. As what we eat comes full circle. And the people with a passion for baking get a chance. The great shape. That a social trend would have made impossible just even a few years ago.